I know it doesn't feel like spring outside, but we're excited about the spring season that we have coming up here that's going to start in a few months. So uh, just to kind of lead things off uh, with our men's golf program, we had a, had a really solid fall season dating back to when we opened competition this season and uh, played four fall events which we made significant improvements in. Uh, and we've been working in a number of new guys in our program, and we'll touch on those new guys here in a little bit. But our fall, four fall tournaments we played uh, in Iowa City, we played at a Midwest Region Classic in Galena, Illinois, which had 32 teams from the D Division III uh, level, and we finished seventh out of those 32 teams this year. That's an improvement uh, over last year, and our top individual is Brandon Russell, who finished uh, in the top three as an individual at that tournament out of 167 some players. So we were excited about his performance there as well as our team performance. Uh, we went to St. Mary's University and played in an event up there and finished second and then we finished out our fall season by hosting our own invite which we had a, a smaller number of teams but our top team won that event and our second team uh, finished fifth in that event. So we were excited about the fall season that we had. Uh, a few of the guys that we have been working into our program, uh, like I talked about Brandon Russell. Uh, Brandon's uh, a returning all-conference performer for us from a year ago who has a freshman finished ninth in the conference. Uh, you know, we're excited about what he's done this fall and has an opportunity to do this spring as well. Uh, and Matt Mackler is a senior for us uh, that returned and played in our top five and has played in our top five uh, throughout his entire career. So those are two returning guys that uh, we're going to lean on heavily for our spring season. Uh, we graduated three seniors last year. That, that played a lot for us the last couple of years, and one of those being Tanner Randall, who won the Iowa Conference Championships a year ago uh, as a senior, setting the 72-hole record. Uh, and so he's a guy that we're looking to replace uh, with a number of guys in our program this year. So uh, with that being said, some of the new guys that we're, we're working in the mix, Landon Pace uh, came to us this, this fall, and he had a really good fall season. He started off a little bit slower than his expectations, uh, but turned it on nicely and ended up winning our end individual championship for our fall invite uh, himself and then uh, we also have Micah Harbor, a freshman from Minnesota that's been playing in, and out of, in our top five a little bit uh, as well as Carson Bellis, a freshman from Dubuque Senior uh, as well, along with a few other guys and so just to touch on those guys uh, in our program and we're, we're excited about what we can do this spring. Our spring schedule, we open up with our hosted invite early April. Uh, hopefully the weather cooperates and we have a large number of teams coming to that to that event. And then we will play the following weekend up in Minnesota at St. Mary's hosted invite. And then we have, we have our break in between uh, our winter term and our, our May term here on campus. And so we'll take a trip with our guys and play there. And then we return to our, Iowa, or our American River Conference Championships uh, the following week when we get back. And the first and second rounds are at Finkbein in Iowa City. And the third and fourth rounds this year are going to be May 4th and 5th. Uh, or May 3rd and 4th, sorry, out in Lincoln, Nebraska, hosted by Nebraska Wesleyan this year. So uh, we have some some high expectations for our group. Uh, with that being said, there's going to be a little bit more inexperience this year than we've had in the past, but we're excited about what this group can accomplish and uh, looking forward to, to compete for a conference championship in the spring of the year. Well, hopefully we can get started uh, sometime in, in mid-March. Uh, and if the weather cooperates, hopefully we can get out on the course sometime around that time or shortly thereafter because our, our hosted invite at the beginning of April is right around the corner after that. So, But we do utilize, uh, once we do a start official practice in March, we do utilize the indoor facilities we have here as well as uh, potentially out at the course as well. And so our guys spend some time on their own this time of the year and uh, use our indoor hitting area here as well as our indoor putting area and uh, just try to prepare themselves for the start of official practice when we get going in, in the middle of March.